Welcome to the final session in this course for admin users. We will have a closer look at how to create and manage marketing lists. The ability to source, segment, and qualify contacts on Nexel for marketing campaigns is one of the key use cases on our platform. Traditional standalone email marketing systems are often very difficult to keep up to date, thanks to the automated capturing of new contacts in our enrichment process. Nexel can help you continuously grow your distribution lists with new relationships gained throughout the firm. With powerful filters that leverage the enrichment data and customizable marketing settings, you can also up your segmentation game and deliver better targeted, more personalized marketing campaigns to keep your firm top of mind with your clients and prospects. Let's have a closer look. The Marketing List module can be accessed under the firm-wide section in the navigation menu. Note that the Marketing Lists module will be visible for both individual users, as well as admin users. Individual users, however, will not be able to manage or change marketing lists, only view them. Admin users, on the other hand, will be able to create, manage, and remove lists. When entering the Marketing list section, you will see all of the marketing lists ordered chronologically by creation date. You can use the top search bar to find a particular list of interests or use the category drop-down fields to view a particular set of lists in a certain category. With the drop-down menu on the right-hand side, you can change the order of the list and reorder them alphabetically or chronologically by the last update. Admin users can create a new list by clicking on the blue button on the top right of the screen. By creating new marketing lists, you can name it as you wish and assign it to one of the categories available. Once your list has been created, you can start adding contacts. There are various ways to add contacts to a marketing list. The first one is by adding contacts individually using the Add Contact link. This method is likely to be used when a particular lawyer requests you to add a contact to the specific marketing list. The second way to add contacts to a marketing list is by requesting them from a group of users. By clicking on the Request Contacts link, Nexel will generate a unique URL, which you can then circulate by an irregular email or by chat. When your Nexel users receive that email and click through on this URL, they will be taken to a Nexel screen from where they can select contacts and add them to the marketing list with a single click. Imagine you will be hosting a breakfast seminar on new tax legislation. You can use this Request Contacts function to send an email to all lawyers of the tax team, requesting to go through their list of contacts on Nexel and add relevant contacts as they see fit. The third way to add contacts from within a marketing list itself is by importing contacts from a spreadsheet. You will find the Import Contacts button on the top right of your screen. Specifics on how the import motion works were explained in the previous session of this admin course on importing. Finally, all users can add contacts to various lists, including marketing lists, from within an individual contact record or a contact list. When a user goes to My Contacts and opens up a contact, you will see the List Membership section at the bottom of a contact record. You will see both marketing lists, project lists, and private contact lists in this section. You can spot the marketing lists by the envelope icon right before the list name. All current lists to which this contact has been added already appear in this section. You can also remove someone from a marketing list here. By using the Add to List button, users can select the marketing lists or any other list to which they can subscribe the individual contact. Note that you can also add contacts to a list in the submenu with the three dots as shown on the screen. What's really important to understand is that you can also add contacts to marketing lists in bulk. You can use one or more filters to identify a group of contacts and then use the checkbox to select those contacts you wish to subscribe to a marketing list. Just use the Add to List link on top of your contacts to move them into the marketing list of your choice. This works both for individual users in My Contacts as well as for admin users who can source contacts from the All Contacts section. Nexel offers additional tools to help you manage your contacts and marketing lists. For law firms with advanced or large-scale marketing operations, the Marketing Settings section on Contact Records can help you manage things such as consent status as well as various preferences in a comprehensive yet easy-to-use way. You can indicate the consent status, how that consent was given, and when it was given in this pop-up form. Similarly, you can manage practice area or sector preferences and any other categories you would like to use in the preference management form. Note that these settings need to be configured by Nexel. 
If you would like to know more about these preference options, please contact Nexel's client services team and we'd be happy to help you out. Nexel can seamlessly integrate with various leading email marketing and automation platforms such as MailChimp, Concept, Eloqua, Brevo, Eventagy, and others. This allows firms to push marketing lists directly into the audiences or lists on your EMS and, conversely, can receive engagement data from your EMS to further enrich your relationship data on the platform. This brings us to the end of this session. Thanks for your time and attention. For any further questions, contact our client services team or your main Nexel contact. Goodbye.